suspension setup by dialing in our pump pressure. So we're starting here at the hydrant, and we got the inline flow meter. So we're going to zoom into the flow meter. We're flowing at 7 8 tip, and our goal is 160 gallons a minute. So this is flowing about 160 gallons a minute. Now we're going to walk up to the engine and check out the pressures over there. Now we've got the front crossway pulled, and this is pumping at 80 right here. But notice the difference between our pump discharge and our line discharge. We got about 105 coming off of here and about 80 coming off of here. So if you're gonna look at either number, this is the one that you gotta be looking at. Now we're gonna walk up. And we've got gauges spread uh, 100 feet apart. So we're gonna mark, see what the uh, see what the friction loss is here. So this is our first. This is 50 feet off of the engine, and we're flowing at about 75. This is 100 feet away from the first gauge we looked at, and we're flowing at about 55. So that's 100 feet difference between these. So in this particular hose, this is key combat, we've got about 20 pounds friction loss. Now let's move up to the, to the nozzle. We're flowing a 7-8 smooth bore tip, flowing 160 gallons a minute. Our, our pressure here should be at 50. So then we know we're flowing 160 gallons a minute. So that takes us from the from the hydrant showing the flow to which gauge we should be looking at to our friction loss in the hose and ends with the discharge here. 